Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? For the cheapest coins anywhere, check out MMOEXP.com and use code ZERK for 5% off your order. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing. Season 3 is out and Team of the Week just dropped, but there's some other information we need to go over for some content coming up in Season 3 that looks pretty good. Now, I do want to give a shout out to Chiefs on Top for being a part of the Nota Gang. If you guys want a chance to shout out in the next video, drop a like in the vid, make sure you guys are sub to the channel, to notification bell on and comment down below, Nota Gang. Also, guys, my NBA picks for tonight are out right now. We had a couple of wins last night. We'll see what we can do, but if you guys check out Underdog Fantasy right now using code ZERK, they will double your first deposit up to $100. And you guys will get this Joe Burrow 0.5 total yard special for Thursday night football tomorrow. We have been scorching hot with NFL. We'll see if we can keep that streak up tomorrow. But tonight, we have NBA. Check out my picks. I will do some halftime picks as well. And I'll have one more for the late game. All right, so let's go over some of this information before we take a look at Team of the Week. But starting off, we have some information about Blitz. Now, this, I believe, was over on EA's website. But if you guys don't know, the Blitz promo is the Black Friday promo. Uh, it drops every single year, usually around like midnight, maybe a little bit sooner, maybe like 8 p.m., 9 p.m., 10 p.m., whatever, on Thanksgiving night. Uh, obviously right before Black Friday and then it's like a bunch of special offers that you get uh, it definitely is a money spender promo make no mistake about it we'll see exactly how no money spent friendly EA is uh, with it this year but the blitz promo as you guys can see earn dominant rookies in a class of their own during blitz premiere starting November 23rd chase 92 overall champions equipped with a speed rating boost Pick up an upgradable player item at login and play the fast-paced Blitz OT House Rules mode for more rewards. So usually the Blitz promo is usually fast players. You know, we get we tend to get like Lamar Jackson maybe in there. Uh, Deion Sanders, you got him in years past. We're going to get some fast players, but it seems as though the Blitz promo this year is more so going to be around rookies, it appears, which... Sounds amazing to me. Bijan Robinson, uh, Devin Witherspoon, uh, Puka Nakua. You know, there's a lot of really, really good players that we could see. Now, on top of that, though, guys, we also already know that there is going to be a cover athletes promo coming. Now, we don't know what day exactly, but if I had to guess what day the cover athletes promo is going to be coming, it would probably be two weeks from tomorrow. That would be my guess there, because next Thursday, we, of course, have, you know, Harvest Part 2, uh, and then we have, you know, the Blitz promo going into that weekend whatever i would imagine it'll probably be the following weekend right there uh before we get into zero chill that being said though they did put out a trailer over on ea madden nfl on twitter and in the trailer michael vick was talking about some of the promos coming for season three uh where he did mention the cover athletes promo and they had these playing in the background right here as you guys can see ray lewis of course he was a cover athlete marshall falk he was a cover athlete and rob gronkowski he was a cover athlete so we already know if three players that are going to be coming in that promo Falk I'm very excited for him he could be very very good obviously an amazing receiving back Ray Lewis if they give him good speed and Gronk all right guys so season three is here you guys see him already season level two it's been out since like 11 a.m but there was another glitch unfortunately I missed out on it as you guys can see though here are the special offers for season three and you know what's funny is the same exact thing actually happened in season two and I was able to buy all the packs but as you guys can see uh, it was only available for like two minutes apparently but yes all of the offers when stuff dropped to 130 with team of the week and everything yeah uh, you could just go ahead and buy them all so I don't know why the same kind of issues keep happening. Uh, also, I do know right now that daily objectives are not working. As you guys can see, if we come into here, you can see I have completed my daily objectives, but uh, the tracker, you can see, right? It uh, isn't saying that I completed it. And then also my daily objective here obviously is not updating either. This same issue has happened with season two. I think even day one of Madden, like this same issue was here. But season two, same thing. Daily objectives weren't working. Uh, the special offers were instantly glitched and available to buy. So yeah, same issue again. Two of the same issues happen again. I don't understand how. But team of the week, as you guys can see, we have Dak Prescott. Uh, he doesn't get Howard Master. He doesn't get Sefi lead. I'll be honest, I'm not even doing a gameplay with him today. There's really just no point. The card is nothing special at all. 87 speed, 90 throw power, 91, 90, 90 for the accuracies, 90 throw under pressure. Has generic to release, so not great. You're going to need Gunslinger on him. 
He's really, I know in real life, he is definitely a top five quarterback this season. If you want to argue with me on that, by the way, take a look at the stats and uh, come back to me after that. 88 acceleration as well. Uh, he does also have 86 change of direction, but as I said, really no good abilities on him. Then we also have Sheldon Rankins. Really not anything special. 90 block shed, 82 speed, 87 excel. Uh, 90 power move right there. We do also have the angry runs, uh, which is Damon and Joku. This card is pretty solid overall. 90 speed, also has 91 excel, you know, solid route running. Uh, we do, of course, have the CJ Stroud, which if you guys equip the berry boost cam, is going to go up to a 93. And then for team of the week, Let's see if we can find the LTDs for today. Mike Evans and Robert Spillane. Mike Evans, 91 speed, 90 XL, 6'5", you know, solid route running, you know, solid hands as well. Really nothing too crazy with this Team of the Week drop. It, it truly, truly is nothing crazy. Robert Spillane, 90 speed, 89 XL, uh, gets Lurk Artist. Yeah, kind of, kind of mid. And as I said, guys, Season 3 is here, so you can go ahead and start grinding out stuff here. Uh, work your way up. I did go over all of the Season 3 uh, rewards earlier today if you guys want to check that video out we also do have rare strategy items which are now in the game if you guys go ahead come over to the store we'll take a look and see here is the pack still 7500 coins it is. Okay, so if you open this up, you get a common or better. There are some rare strategy items out there. There's some out there that are actually really, really good. This one, I believe, is a rare because it, like, did the extra. Yep, there you go. Medium route specialist plus three to medium route running. But uh, as of, like, a couple minutes ago, it also wasn't working with the team. At least when I tried to put it in my team, it didn't work. As you guys see, I have some of these, though. Uh, let's see if it works. And... Yeah, okay, looks like it did. So it looks like it was just waiting for 130 to come around and then it was actually gonna work there. So let me just go ahead and put my throw power back on. But there are some really, really good uh, new rare strategy items as well out there, like plus two to man coverage. One that gives you like plus three to zone. I saw one with like plus three to... A uh, man as well. There are some really, really good ones. By the way, lineup update video. AP is now up to nine on defense. I might do that actually today. A lot of you guys have been asking me to do a lineup update video, so I might have to do that today. Uh, we have Warriors of the Week pack right here if you guys want to go ahead and open that up. But we'll get into some Team of the Week packs. Definitely a whole lot of stuff going on today. Now, remember though, tomorrow morning, guys, we are going to get the competitive pass reveal. The competitive pass does refresh on Friday. So, refreshes on Friday. Tomorrow, we have the Harvest promo coming out. We have Patrick Mahomes coming out. That card is going to be uh, very, very good. In my opinion, probably QB1, as you get an 88 overall right there. We also get an 82. Uh, but I will likely do a line of date video today. I got to go into my team. I got to adjust stuff. You know, AP going up to nine. That's really, really big. So uh, I'm very excited for that. I'm really excited for nine AP on defense. Open up a couple more packs though, and then take a look at the auction house. We'll see exactly what things are going for here as we get a 76 overall Daniel Scott. Would not imagine that Dak is going to be all that expensive. As I said, no Howard Master, no Sedfi lead. Not a crazy good release. I know he has solid speed, which I saw a lot of people talking about that actually, how, you know, Mahomes only has, I think it was 80 speed and Dak has 87. To be honest, I think Dak might be faster. Like, like truthfully, I think Dak might actually just be faster overall. But also in terms of Madden here, uh, I don't think the EA really wanted to give us, you know, Patrick Mahomes and make him like, you know, 90 speed and then have us have a set feet lead or hot route master quarterback because that's what Mahomes is. Mahomes can get set feet lead or can get hot route master and is like the most mobile of those quarterbacks. So in my opinion, that makes him QB1. I will definitely do a gameplay with him tomorrow and uh, we'll probably pick him up with the team as well, to be honest. So let's go ahead and take a look at Team of the Week, guys, and we'll see what these cards are going for. Let me know down below what mutt level you guys are. I am definitely about to be grinding out my mutt level today, though. I uh, definitely will tell you that. And it looks like Dak is already about 600K. Really, uh, no surprise there. Sheldon Rankins, not even up. Also kind of no surprise. I'm not really sure who really wants Sheldon Rankins. Uh, Mike Evans, 600,000 coins. And then the middle linebacker as well, guys, is currently going for 600K. So, yeah, that's Team of the Week. Angry runs, if you guys are curious as to how much maybe the David Njoku is. In case you guys want to go ahead and scoop this card up, uh, he is 541K. 
I don't really feel like he's necessarily worth that, but uh, is what it is. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like on it. Hit that sub button down below. I will probably catch you guys later tonight with a lineup update going over my new 9 AP defense and kind of just in general showcasing the team. Been a long time since I did one of those. Definitely got to grind out the season pass, try to get that XP. Obviously, the uh, player rewards in the field pass, though, in my personal opinion, maybe not as OP as they should be. If you guys enjoyed this video, check out these.